Hello and welcome. It is 8 o'clock. It is the 31st day of August 2021, I think. I am your grumpy guide to all things gaming, the OGGM. Tomorrow is August 1st, which means it is the first day of RPG A Day 2021. It's eighth year in a row that this individual has put on this free contest, challenge, whatever you want to call it. Um, it was started by David F. Chapman, who is a gamer, writer, game designer, and developer, editor, illustrator, comics publisher, and in other things. He's been very prevalent in working in several different role-playing games, including Army of Darkness, Doctor Who Adventures in Time and Space, uh, Star Trek Adventures, and of course being the founding voice behind RPG A Day. Uh, it's a chance to have gamers from all over the world create projects celebrating the hobby of role-playing. It's done throughout the, the month of August, starting tomorrow. I've done it every year for as long as I've been aware of it. Um, it used to be questions, and then about two years ago, they changed it to prompts. So I don't really know what gave them the idea, other than I assume, you know, there's always quite questions floating around about role playing like when was your first game who's your favorite npc what's your favorite dice what's your favorite genre what's the best deep you know natural 20 story you have what's the best natural one story you have those have been floating around as long as there's been a hobby uh best guess he just wanted to make this sort of an organized way for people to answer these questions so when i first discovered it it was questions it was tell me about your world what's your favorite npc Stuff like that, you know. Every day was a different question, and you could have answer it any way you want. You could do vlogs, blogs, art projects, whatever. You could, uh, interviews, uh, and it went through all the month of August. Um, I always kind of thought it should be more trivia based, you know, like what was the not only what was the first adventure you ever ran, but questions like what's the first adventure. But I, you know, once I started going through it, I appreciated it a lot more. Though there was a lot of repetitively, repetitiveness in the questions until they switched. So about three years ago, they switched from asking you questions to giving you prompts. And you could approach those prompts in any way you want. So here we have the RPG A Day 2021 prompts. The very first one is scenario. So you could talk about scenarios. You could write about scenarios. You could vlog about scenarios you could do an art project about scenarios you could talk about what your first scenario is what your favorite scenario is how you design scenarios you could argue the whole rgm storytellers or rgms not storytellers thing it's a prompt so there's no right or wrong answer and it's forcing you to use your imagination think outside the box and come up with you know whatever your interpretation of that word is and how you would present it to the audience and then as you see, we go through the month, we have other prompts, but then we have alternative prompts. So if you don't like, say, August 4th, which is my birthday, by the way, question, uh, prompt weapon, you could change it to search, reward, or figure, or I suppose even do your own. Uh, they have a Facebook page dedicated to RPG A Day. Uh, there is a website sponsored by the uh, founder, David Chapman, where he talks about his own work and blogs his RPG A Day adventures. Other individuals like myself have done this, you know, I've done blogs, I've done art. I've, of course, every day tried to answer the question of the prompt. And once again, this year, I will be doing the exact same thing. RPG A Day starts tomorrow. I'll be starting with the very first question scenario. Uh, my birthday is August 4th. We'll talk about that. I might be taking some time off in the second week of August to uh, go out of town. I don't know. Because Delta variant. Because, yes, we can't have any nice things. But so hopefully, if you see this vlog and this is something you appreciate, you might want to join me in the I don't know, dozens of other people across the world who do this. Uh, the questions have been translated into multiple languages. So if you don't speak English and you speak like Portuguese or Spanish, uh, they have been presented and people from all over the world have responded time and time again for the eighth years. And so now's a chance to get to cater, get creative, spread the word about our, your favorite hobby, 
think of new, interesting, imaginative ways to with these prompts um, and celebrate RPG every day for the day of August. You know, and you don't have to do it every day. Some people do like two or three in a row. Some people don't, you know, answer like one and then they'll do like day one, day 12, day 30, because, you know, there's the only ones they really are talking about. There's no right or wrong way to do this. I've tried to do every day and do a vlog every day about the one. This might be the first year where I miss some. Uh, so, yeah, hopefully you will join me in doing RPG a day and posting either on Facebook or on your own vlog or your own blog or your own website or whatever. And doing you can do talk about it you could do art you could do pictures you could you know interview people there's no right or wrong way to do it it's just a fun way to celebrate rpgs so hopefully you will join me starting tomorrow for rpg a day 2021 till next time i am your grumpy guide to all things gaming if you appreciate this content and want to see more let me know if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe help me hit 1000 subs by i don't know 2025 that's a good goal right till next time uh, stay creative. RPG a day. I will talk to you later.